G'day tubers. It's Saturday morning and I have have a lot planned. These batteries are going to make make a big transformation. I'm going to try and get them sort of finished a little bit. Working on a way that I can fit them in my rack mount. Um, so I've made these bits a little bit higher so I can actually sit them together and then bend them over and join them up. Um, I've used some Sikaflex to um, bond the actual copper to the plastic down here and it seems to be quite strong so I'm quite happy with that bond um, and certainly all the rest of them that I had done just broke off and snapping um, wires and stuff like that so that's that needs to be addressed that's all right that's why you do test ones don't you now primary reason for this video Sean link below he's making his own power wall. it is cool it is running it is working and check out his channel he's only got he's only got um this is his first video for his power wall um he has commented a few times on my video but he's been talking a lot on facebook so please give him a sub give him a few likes um, check out his videos and hopefully he uploads more about um, the process that was Sean's power wall. Looks really good, so it's worth a check out, guys. Um, sub to his channel and he'll probably start uploading more stuff, I reckon. Anyway, that's me for now. I got heaps of work to do. I gotta go out and buy, pick up um, 12 new solar panels. Um, that will bring me to about. 10 kilowatts of solar panels I think give or take um, so that'll be a good little addition to charging capabilities um, especially when I actually plan on doing a lot bigger than just a 10 kilowatt power wall um, considering I have access to thousands and thousands of batteries if I can't sell them I'm going big I'm gonna try and do a 50 kilowatt power wall um, it might take some time because once I get it running things will sort of slow down a little bit because I've got to spend money on other things because I've dropped some serious cash into these in the last two weeks. Um, got myself a new soldering iron, a hundred dollars. Doesn't work. It doesn't work anywhere near as good as the twenty dollar one off eBay. Grr, do you hate that? Anyway, I'm baffling on. I'm out of here. I'll see you on the next one. Cheers guys.